The U.S. and Russia have been friends on and off for decades. World War II, on. The Cold War, off. Lately, it's kind of been somewhere in between. That's because of a little thing known as the Russia investigation. Here's how it all started. What we know is that Russia tried to influence the 2016 U.S. presidential election in favor of Donald Trump in two ways. Hacking and releasing emails and using bots to spread fake news on social media. What we don't know is did Team Trump go all in with the Russians on it? Here's a quick timeline. April 2016. One of Trump's former campaign advisors reportedly offers to set up a meeting between Trump and Russian President Vladimir Putin. The advisor also hears from a contact that the Russians have info that would hurt Hillary Clinton's reputation. June 2016. A few people on Trump's campaign meet with a Russian lawyer at Trump Tower. Why? To try and talk about the dirt Russia allegedly had on Hillary. July 2016. Because of rumors about some members of the Trump campaign's relationship status with Russia, the FBI opens an official investigation, but it's still on the down low. November 2016, Trump is elected to be the 45th president of the United States of America. December 2016, President Obama announces sanctions against Russia as punishment for them trying to manipulate the US election. That same day, Trump's future national security advisor, Michael Flynn, talks sanctions with a Russian ambassador. This was a convo he later pled guilty to lying about to the FBI and Vice President Mike Pence. Not a good look. February 2017, Michael Flynn resigns. The very next day, newly inaugurated President Trump allegedly asks FBI Director James Comey to stop the investigation into Flynn and the Russians. May 2017, President Trump fires James Comey and later says it was because of the Russia investigation. Now, there are three groups trying to connect all of these dots. The House Intelligence Committee, the Senate Intelligence Committee, and the Department of Justice. The House officially ended their investigation. They say Team Trump is innocent. The Senate's investigation is still happening. So far, they say Russia definitely tried to influence the election, but TBD if Trump's team had anything to do with it. The investigation Trump has been tweeting the most about is the DOJ one. That's led by a guy named Robert Mueller. He's an attorney, a Vietnam veteran, and a former FBI director. So far, he's charged four people connected with the Trump campaign with some type of crime. A few have pleaded guilty, and no one knows when he'll wrap things up. So down that shot of vodka, because this definitely isn't over yet. 